Welcome. This video will help you understand how to use Buffer CMS. You can grab a page from JS Fiddle and then add it to your website. So let's get right into it. Here's a link. And when I click this button, I want it to direct me to a new page called thechef.html. Now let's take a look. When I click this, there's nothing happening and showing a page with an error sign. So what should I do? Easy. Type in buffer.org on the address bar of your internet browser. A search engine lookalike page will appear. Then on this box, type in or copy your own website address and paste it. I'm pasting mine, for example. Click Start Editing. Voila! Now anything is changeable. You can add space between text, change the text, change whatever you want. I'll change this button's link. Click on this button, then select Change URL and change it to thechef.html. Now click Create a new page for the link, then Create page from JS Fiddle. This is a JS Fiddle page where you keep your code saved. You can do your coding and save it here for later use. Just make sure that the HTML code of the fiddle doesn't contain body element. Body element is not supposed to be written in the HTML pane of JS Fiddle. If it does, this will end up with two body elements in your new page. And if you need to add some attribute to the body, like I do, here's where you can do that. After that, paste your JS Fiddle link. I'm pasting mine here. Click Look Up. Click this button called Create Page from this JS Fiddle. It will open up a page where all the changed code is visible. Click Save and Create. Now click on Finish at the top. Then click here and type in the FTP access. Then click Accept and the page will be updated on the server as well. Congratulations, you did very well. Let's check out from the drop down below and see if it works or not. Click the main page and then click on the button where you changed the link and click follow the link. If everything is done as I said, then you should have a new perfectly working page from JS Fiddle. Thanks for watching and stay updated.